ट्वेंटी फर्स्ट सेंचुरी के जो इस दौर में जहां सिनेमा हर पल अपना अंदाज बदल रही है ऐसे में एक नौजवान हमारे बीच में जो आया है ये जो हमारे भाई हैं मिस्टर कॉस्टा योगी इनके दिल से बहुत ही अनोखी कहानी पैदा हुई है इनमें इन्होंने इसमें संगीत भी दिया है और इनका अपने डायरेक्टर भी यही है तो ये फिल्म जो है रीचा इसमें सेंट्रल किरदार निभा रही है और ये एक बहुत ही एंगेजिंग म्यूजिक से भरपूर एक एज ऑफ द सीट एक्सपीरियंस करते हैं ये ऐसी फिल्म है और ये आ, जब आएगी तो वो जो एक हमारी परंपरा है ऑफ एक्साइटिंग एंगेजिंग म्यूजिकली वेरी रिच सिनेमा उसको जिंदा रखेगी मेरा ख्याल से आई दिस टू इज ऑफ माई करियर आई कैन आस्क फॉर एनी थिंग बेटर पूजा इज माई हीरो पूजा इज माई फ्रेंड पूजा इज माई फैमिली एंड सब लोग जानते हैं कि अच्छा बेस द पर्सन हुआ गिवन मी एट आई हैव बिन बेस्ट वर्किंग इन सिक्स फिल्म विद अच्छा एंड एट दिस स्टेज ऑफ माई लाइफ लिटरली ऑन द नाइन्थ ऑफ फेल टू बी वर्किंग इन अ फिल्म विद डेड इट्स अ ह्यूज ह्यूज थिंग फॉर मी थैंक कॉस्टी वेरी वेरी यू नो आई मेट कॉस्टी विद पूजा एंड आई लव द स्टोरी and uh, to work with richa to do a song with her i mean <laughs> an amazing amazing actor i've seen her work and i saw the rushes also of this film i think she's going to do a lot of all of them she did really well she did a remarkable job and uh, luckily uh, with vishesh films meri puri career gaano se bani मगर ये पूजा भट्ट फिल्म से ये ये विशेष फिल्म की नहीं 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 आपकी लॉन्च जो थी विशेष फिल्म से हुई थी इनफैक्ट ये लोग जानते नहीं होंगे कि मैं एक्चुअली आशिकी करने वाली थी आपके साथ में और मुझे इसी मुगल भट्ट साहब मेरे घर आए थे इतने मतलब इतने सारे गुड्डी नोट के साथ लेके बोले की पूजा भट्ट आपका ये फाइनिंग अमाउंट है और मैंने कहा कि नहीं मैं फिल्मों में काम नहीं करूंगी क्योंकि मैं आई वॉन्ट टू बी मैरिड आई वॉन्ट टू बी कंजर्वेटिव आई बिलीव इन लव तो लव ने मुझे वहां पर भी मार दिया उसके बाद में सेट पे गई बहुत जलन हुई और उसके बाद मैंने कहा क्या भी दिया मैंने आप देखते ही उसके अंदर एक अजीब सी गहरी गलती की है आज की मैं कर नहीं पाई तो मैंने क्या किया कि इस फिल्म में कैमरे में हमारा जो सिग्नेचर गाना है पानी पानी जो इन्होंने लिखा है तो पानी पानी में we we show Richa's ascent into stardom and uh, we wanted Rahul Roy to do a cameo playing Rahul Roy. So Rahul Roy is playing himself and we are recreating the whole आशिकी तो मैंने आशिकी में काम नहीं किया था एज एन एक्टर मगर मैंने आशिकी का पोस्टर चुरा के कैमरे में डाल दिया है और राहुल रॉय को भी चुरा के कैमरे में डाल दिया कहानी एक ऐसी लड़की की है जो झारखंड से है और उसकी जिंदगी में कोई घटना घटती है जिसके कारण वो बहुत दूर ट्रैवल करके एक बहुत लंबा फासला पर्सनालिटी और लाइफ में निकालती है और उसके बाद हम देखते हैं कि उसका बिल्कुल काया पलट हो चुकी है उसकी और उसको किसी से इश्क होता है उसका एक कोई सीक्रेट है फिल्म में कि या तो किसी से भाग रही है या कुछ है वो आप टिकट खरीद के देख सकते हैं कि क्या है तो मैं कहूँगी बहुत हैवी ड्रामा है उसमें थ्रिल का एलिमेंट बहुत स्ट्रांग है एंड एट द सोल ऑफ इट इट्स अ लव स्टोरी इट्स अ स्टोरी ऑफ अ गर्ल फ्रॉम झारखंड स्टोरी ऑफ अ गर्ल फ्रॉम स्मॉल टाउन इंडिया टू फाइन अ वे टू मुंबई मुंबई से दुबई पहुंच जाती है और दुबई के बाद वो बॉलीवुड में और हिंदुस्तान की सबसे बड़ी मशहूर इट गर्ल बन जाती है तो दैट्स द जर्नी ऑफ द गर्ल 
Yeah, well, I mean, I think Gabriel, as he sums it up best, is love, life, death, dance. dance. So, love, life, death, dance. That's what you're going to get to see in Gabriel. So, yes, she had to dance, and yes, there were many apprehensions that people had. That, yes, of course, the whole world knew Gerita Chadda was a fantastic actor. But can she be glamorous? Is the question. My point is that it, you need new eyes. They say that people need new eyes, new eyes. So, apparently, to me, she's the most glamorous thing, and I'm sure you guys all agree. So I'm going to make sure that people eat, 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 eat their words after this and she's done a marvelous job and yes, she had to reverse. Yes. And when you're working with Caesar, you can't get away with doing anything mediocre. He's a tough taskmaster. <laughs> yeah. And we're doing a song that he's written, so why don't you sing that song for us right now? <laughs> What's the song? Yeah, could you say something about the orientation thing also, what the scene was really all about? Like Rahul is there, Shikya exactly, What's the song? This, the, the song we're shooting right now is a song called Pani Pani, which has been composed by Kostev. It's been written by him. Written by him in a very unique place. Written by him in Janta Dance and uh, Janta Bar on Pali Hill at 9:30 in the morning. <laughs> and then he came to the producer and he said, "I've written a song. If it's good, will you give me a beer? I heard the song. I gave him six beers. So that's the story behind Pani Pani. <laughs> and that's what we're shooting right now. The song appears in the film where you show Richa's character going from being a nobody to becoming a superstar. So we show her from going from a low line dancer to being a first job to becoming, you know, a popular girl. So she's doing." A cameo with Rahul Roy doing the Ashiki bit, that's what we got in the world. So now I'm going to make Kasti sing that song. I'll only sing the first two lines. I'll 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 sing the first two गुमु गली गली बन के तेरी दीवानी न तो पानी पानी ये ऐसा कुछ ऐसा कुछ है आगे और भी है बड़ा सब नो इट्स इंस्पायर्ड बाय लाइफ आई थिंक एंड कॉस्टी एग्रीज एंड वी ऑल बिलीव दैट आई थिंक लाइफ इज़ फार मोर ड्रामेटिक दैन फिक्शन को देखो भी and the cabaret is a movie that all all we did was throw a title at him. I must say that this man and me go back like 16, 17 long years. He's been an advertising professional and was always too afraid to take that first big step into movie making. And I pushed him into doing it. So we gave him a title and said, "Hamare paas hi title hai cabaret. Aap kahan hi likhpaenge?" And he came back to us with this story, which we thought was very unique. And all my movies have always got a very very strong central female character. So cabaret. Reinstates that again because the movie, like I said, Richa is my hero. This is her story. You begin with her. It's her journey. It's her fight. It's her anger. And uh, I believe that only he could come up with this because it's his baby completely. It's his music. It's his dialogue. It's his screenplay, lyrics, and script. And all I'm doing is backing him up and making sure that they all shine. And of course, this insane person sitting right here, Mr. Rahul Mitra, represents waves and Rajiv Chajadi, who's crazy enough to sponsor me and put give me money to make my crazy movies. <laughs> and he's crazier than all of us put together. Yeah. <laughs> there were some reports that said it's inspired from Well, uh, there were many reports, but like as we all learned with the media, when there are many reports, you should let those reports continue. Because the more you get written about it, longer you spend the name of your movie correctly and put the right picture. How does it matter? I mean, Helen G is an inspiration. When you say the word cabaret, you can't help but think of Helen. And whenever people ask me who would you like to cast in the movie, I said somebody like Helen G. And I wish there was that. So finally, I found the feature. Well, I'm I'm producing Cabaret. I'm directing Jason Three, which I'm starring in September this year, and uh, I'm going to be acting in a film that my father has written for me. It's a very special film. It's actually Daddy Reversed. It's a story about a singer who's an alcoholic who goes back to form ties with a child she abandoned when she was about 21 years old. And I think that in this country we do not see women of a certain age on screen enough, and we don't talk about things like alcoholism dealing with women enough. Uh, it's always a man who's portraying and dealing with issues like this. So I think that when you talk about even parenthood, if a father leaves his child, the world will give that man a chance to come back. Like we showed that in Daddy. But when a woman abandons her child for a career, goes away selfishly and then wants to come back, the world makes her feel like she's a villain. So that's the kind of theme it is. So I'm doing that, and I think I've got a pretty full year this year. So I'm doing a lot. But once an actor, always an actor. You can't forget, you know. Could you say something? Uh, see, number one, uh, fish, I, Pooja, Bhatt, Kostav, 
I think that's these names are enough uh, for any studio to feel secure about. Apart from our amazing professional relationship that we share, and I think with Pooja and Kausal, the best part is the dedication and and what they bring on the table and the honesty in which the scheduling is done and everything, the whole process. Uh, that is something that we are very very proud of. And uh, all I can say is that Wave Cinema is going to go to the last mile, support this film in whatever best we can. And we have been very, very safe as and looking forward and proud of being a part of this. Thank you, sir. Uh, Thank you, sir. Was there any cue for your character or uh, did you have to draw inspiration from somewhere? I know I know. I know you know where you want to be for this character. I had a journey of this. Chika, chika. Um, actually, I had to mostly unlearn because the school of cinema, I have, uh, have made my comfort zone and so it would become easy and uh, it was difficult for me to try something else like I'm doing a lip sync for the first time which is so usual for every other actress but it's difficult it's very difficult it's tough. I know that when I did daddy and I had to lip sync for Dile Ke Manta Nii I mean the whole unit was going to be a big I just couldn't open my mouth and lip sync exactly yeah. it feels very strange that you have to lip sync and the, you know it's unrealistic but we are so used to seeing it and um, I mean the last time I did lip sync was when I was playing a 60 year old woman in Gangs of Vasipur singing Tar Bijli Se Patle and then guys, so a big 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 change for me something totally new and different and uh, I mean I am like other people experiment with, uh, with offbeat I would say that I entered this I entered this thinking it would be an experiment but I've become so comfortable and I'm enjoying the process so much that it's it's changed me as a woman. If you get what I'm saying. Yeah. Well, we are creating all I can say officially right now to y'all for the first time, sir. In your presence, we are creating officially. We are creating we are cre creating a monster, and then she is going to be unleashed on the world on May 6th, and then God save the entire film industry. Because you have a lot of women in power in position of Comment is going to do right. Really, I I don't want to comment because I second what she said. Okay, Rishi, she is going to enter the tanker right now, sir. After you leave. हाँ पानी है फिर बेच जाएंगे बेच जाएंगे पानी में ये गई थी लेकिन हम आशा करते हैं कि बिस्तर आप पकड़ेंगे she's going to be in water today and all of the bodies are going to be in water yes comment to पढ़ने के केस तू नो गुशन ग्रोवर जी as an actor as a person I have I have worked with him in the film cabaret and he is one of the most professional people that I know and always punctual very helpful with his co-star and knows his stuff technically to another level uh, but apart from all that he's a very nice person and I really enjoyed working with him. Best wishes to him for the acting and documentary? No, he's, he's one of the few people who, who, one of the first few people to branch out even to LA and work internationally and he does some incredible work and he's very versatile and uh, um, I, I just hope that I, all of us take inspiration from him, the younger actors and continue to learn and work the way he does. Lastly, he's known as a bad man, you know. So no, he's not. I mean, he's just. Take, huh, sorry. He's really not a bad man. He's a very good, simple Punjabi, normal person who likes his dal chawal and he's very disciplined about everything. He's not a bad man at all. Okay. Gulshan sir, you are a very bad man. 